look at this substation. <laughs> Hello everyone, this is a beautiful sunset in an undisclosed state at an undisclosed location. Why is it undisclosed, you ask? Well, I was recently hired by a power company to do some power line inspections with my drone. And I told them about my YouTube channel and how my viewers would be very interested in seeing some of this footage. And they said that would be fine as long as I kept the location and the name of the company on the DL. That's understandable. So I will share a little bit of this with you. This particular power line inspection took place over a period of about three hours and the footage is very boring. However, I did make a pass between several power lines, pretty much as a demonstration of how precise the Phantom 4 Pro can fly. They were impressed, and the video might make you cringe a little bit. Here it is. I was doing a visual inspection, that means just regular video without any FLIR, forward-looking infrared, or thermal cameras. The company wanted me to check out a stretch of about a mile, starting very close to the substation. They've had a lot of large birds perching up on the poles, and I don't know if you knew this, but bird droppings are the enemy of power lines, especially larger birds because, well, with a larger bird comes larger poo. And as you can see, these power lines are unshielded. So when a large bird makes a poo and it drips down, it can bridge between the power line and ground and cause something called a flashover. Flashovers can cause electricity to arc and then create a lot of heat, thus damaging the lines. And when that happens, it trips the circuit breakers and can cause lots of damage down the line. I was to look for any evidence of this in the form of carbon, and they also wanted to check if there were any dead animals or parts of dead animals, because that's all that would be left after an animal grounded itself up there on the bare wire. I used all seven of my batteries during this inspection and most of the time I was flying a lot slower than this. Again, this is just for effect and to demonstrate how the Phantom 4 Pro can fly without any interference through these unshielded wires. And most of the shots that I made were straight down from above like this. Well, I hope you found that interesting. If you have any questions, I don't know if I can be any specific about the company or where I was, but I hope you enjoyed the visuals. So if you're ever driving along the road and you look over and you see an eagle and he's sitting upon a high tension wire, just know that's a bad thing for the electric company. That said, if you are ever driving along and you see a squirrel sitting on a high tension line, just hope that he grounds himself and explodes because I hate squirrels. I really do. Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. And thanks for not letting your eagle poo all over the wires. Boo and bye. So there's a really bad storm here at my house. And I live right next to a ravine, a, a little drainage ditch thing, and it's really, really flooding right now. I'm just glad I'm renting. <laughs>